Why, hello, and thank you so much for joining me as Game Edge. We're back in, of course, Supermarket Simulator. And a lot of you are saying I should just really jack up the prices and make a lot more money. It goes a lot faster. So debating it, I swear to God. Like, I know they're going to say it's too expensive. I'm being really nice. I'm being market-friendly. <laughs> you guys get in confidence. Tell me if you think I should jack up the price. I think I'm going to do it. I might even do it before the end of this. I'm not sure, but I know we're something we're going to do with the money up top that I've been grinding. Oh, <sighs> okay. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Do we get more? I'm going to just buy more of everything. I'm even like debating and splitting up these fridges and stuff. Things that make like a ton of cash, uh, like uh, this meat here. I'm almost, I'm almost debating just going back to where it was so I can keep more stock in back. Well, less, actually less stock worried in the back and just keep more stuff in here and just expand out with fridge and stuff. The only thing is it costs a fortune to run and I don't want to lose out more money by getting a whole bunch more of those things. That's why I'm being a little bit frugal. It is selling, but I wonder if you sell more if you have more on the shelves. You know what I'm talking about? Like, is that something? Is that something I'm, I have to figure out? Anyways, we're going to try. We're going to try and see. Uh, today, we're doing growth. Uh, just checking the bills first because we have to make sure. <laughs> it's going to be uh, expensive. $11,000. Where is that going to open up? Oh, God. Guys, man, seriously, do something, please. I'm, I'm antsy already. Okay, first one out. Boom. Okay, just did it. It's like, it's like, rip. oh, it's going that way. I got an extra window. I was thinking about putting the caches across here now. People were mentioning that too to me. Uh, this way I could have more space maybe around here and stuff. And yeah, we're going to go for the second one. Oh, just going to go spend all my money. Oh. All right. Okay, one second. I'm going to need, a, I'm gonna need some, uh, some time here. <laughs> all right, all right. Um, yeah. This is good. I still need one more. And how much is the other one? Sorry, just out of curiosity. I, just to make it, because I'd be really beautiful. I don't. I know I don't have the money for it. I know I don't. Twenty fucking thousand. Twenty thousand dollars. Sorry. Holy crap. Licenses. How much is the next license? Five. I don't have that. I'm not taking a loan out. There's no way in hell I'm doing that. There's no way in hell. I, I just I I bolstered up my stuff here. So I'm thinking. I'm thinking I'm being like really too frugal for this stuff. Like anything that makes a lot of money should be stacked like crazy and make them buy it, right? Anything that's making like itsy bitsy coin. These things are all good, you know? I just need more freezers and fridges to get rolling. Okay, you know what? The only way to do it is first of all, hey, let's just make some money. Sorry. Inappropriate behavior yet again. All right, so yeah, I'm thinking we might just have to jack up the prices, dudes. We're gonna do that so we're gonna have to do that i just need a little bit more money to go that direction and i'm thinking well now we have this maybe i can bring these over to this side off came well, right afterwards once we close up the store i'm thinking i'm bringing these across here uh put the cash registers a lot of you were saying i should put them against the wall i just didn't have enough of a distance it was like right up to here so it's like i tried off camera and it just seems to like be a little bit off you know so I'm thinking that might not be a bad idea. We can have these ones go boom, boom here. Move the shelving a little bit more onto that side here. Yeah, that wouldn't hurt, wouldn't it? It really wouldn't hurt. It would look pretty good if we actually had a little more shelving to go this way. And after that, we can kind of work on the other side. I don't know. Uh, when we know they have to move these things. So uh, let's pick this bad boy up while I'm waiting for someone to do something with me here. They're all not answering me. No, they're all not going my line. They don't like me very much. I don't know what it is. I, I, tr I, I told you. I don't know. For some reason, the last episode, they started liking me a bit. Which made me feel better. Just a tiny bit. Uh, yeah, this doesn't look very right there. I don't know if this affects them when they're trying to buy something if I'm ripping out their stuff off them. <laughs> what way to find out, right? I mean... We'll see how they react when I have this up in the air. Maybe I should do it so I'm going to close. Honestly, probably a better idea. Maybe I am affecting the sales for today. Like I said, maybe we're going to jack up the prices too. And uh, have that go. We're going to move everything over across like that. I still need another shot. Oh, sorry. So sorry. Uh huh. Very nice order. Very, very, very nice of you. Uh, yep. Let's not, uh, let's not, uh, not take it. I'm going to save some money here. 55 cents for you. Might be a cashier right now. He looks new. Is that Elon Musk? Is that who it is? Eh, not really, right? It, it kind of looked like him from a distance, but no. no. All right. Hello, ma'am. How are you doing? 
All right, we're good. Thanks for the cash. Thank you for... I don't know why they wait there, but they do wait there. All right, yeah, the shelves are going to get better. Ladies and gents, don't worry. Um, breakfast cereal, most likely going to go here. But I need room for this. This is a problem. Hmm. I'm going to need room on this side. So if I'm going to do that, I'm probably going to have to push and redo all the shelves here. Kind of have to do that. Yeah, we better, better do that off camera because that's just going to be insane or else. I do have a lot of stock, by the way. I spent a lot of money. I did actually start thinking about moving these things together, but now my new thing is to not do that. It's to, you know, anything with good cash, we're going to start piling them up. I kind of want to get everything in order. I can make it $6 off those friggin' Moussaka there. That's pretty good. I mean, I, I don't know why I'm even bothering. I mean, half and half is not so bad either. But I'm thinking the meat should be, like, completely piled in. We should have, like, one fridge for everything, pretty much. <laughs> Maybe we'll have to invest in that. Let's just see if we can get some coin back from all our massive load we just dropped in the back there. Which is all good, right? Uh, that's that's a point. We need to expand and make more money. The only thing is, now I'm going to pay bigger rent. Not happy about that. Not at all. I'm also checking out to see. Every time we're paying the clients up, well, the, uh, the people on top there, You'll see what our money at the end of the day. I've been looking at that for a bit. We've been discussing this, uh, but it looks like I'm not paying them. I don't know what the hell's going on. So it's been a discussion in my head for a while now. Yeah, I definitely don't mind this here, but I think I'm going to have to start preparing myself for a little bit. Whoa, everybody's going out for that weekend, aren't we? My God, did, I don't, do I even need the other cashier over there? He seems to always get all the women. Well, there's some women here too. That's not true, but... He seems to get the party people. I hope he's not giving free stuff away. It'd be kind of shitty, wouldn't it? <laughs> you find out your guy over there is like, yeah, hey, yeah, don't worry about it. Just make it look like we're passing through everything. Uh, 110 to 05. He actually has a little sound on his uh, phone. Beep, beep, beep. Every time he passes by, this is a wave on top of it. Yeah, I definitely need to figure this out. I wish I could get rid of that wall right away. If I get rid of that wall right away, everything just gets a lot better and easier for me. Uh, for that, so we'll see how it goes. Let's just move this together here. Let's get our monies that we can for today, and then we'll finish up the day, and then we'll be able to look at all the goodness. I should be able to run a couple of days with the amount of stuff I have. What the hell? What was that last thing he just got? Beer. Oh, it's a beer. It looked like hot sauce. I was like, don't remember my hot sauce looking like that. It was actually a beer. It looked so small. It looked like a little Tabasco thing, you know? You like that cheese, right, buddy? Huh? All about that cheese. You love your orders, though. One sixty-two point seventy-five. I can. I don't know if I should be jacking up my prices to a point where they're, you know, exorbitant. And I, I don't know. Maybe that's what it is. You, know, you need to just make that coin, no matter what. But I'm not sure if my orders are not, you know, good enough right now, and I'll be able to sell more stuff. The problem is you can like jack up your prices, but I, I see them not buy anything else after they found things too expensive. So they walk up to it and they go, ah, uh, just no, don't bother. And that's the thing that scares me. So yeah, you guys are going to cough. You tell me I should jack up the price. We're not going to do it without you all in there. So please get in there. Tell me if I should jack everything up. I'm talking like, uh, let's let's just take a look at one of these here. Uh, right over here. So this is 865, right? Uh, this one is 846. So I'm saying like, I don't know, change that to like $9 or 950. Like I'm thinking like going jack up to like round it off to the next number. So let's say this is a 579, then we're going to say a 6 or 7, I guess, six six seventy nine. I don't know, something like that. Maybe a buck more for everything. This guy's looking at you like, you're going to do what? <laughs> it's up to them. They need to decide whether we should, you know, be complete assholes, like in real life, and uh, jack up our prices for no apparent reason. Huh? Yeah. Only people allowed to jack up the price of the farmers who work their asses off in the fields. <laughs> me, it's like nothing pisses me off more than getting these chips. And you go and get it. And that's like, literally, it is just in, I'm buying air. And that's what I'm buying now. Unless you go to like big box stores like Costco and stuff. Then, then you get those party bags. And those things are pretty darn full. I don't know. Maybe it's because, you know, they say, don't you dare do that. And they give you more. Because it really seems like a whole lot more in those bags. I know they're bigger, but you get the same bag inside a regular box store. And it's like, oh. It's, there's missing stuff. Uh, I'm going to have to get more lights, right? Yep. Definitely need more lights. So I'm going to need to order three more lights. It's already 9 o'clock, so I won't be able to do that right away. So we'll just click out for the day. We won't start the day. 
We're doing pretty good. Our money going back here, dude. That's pretty cool. I mean, I did put a lot in the side, the uh, inside there, so it doesn't surprise me that I had a lot of cash lying around in there. Just not seeing very much meat go. And I wonder again if that's because of that. I might just want to refill those fridges up, guys. I might just completely empty out everything I have. Like a hundred something of meat in there. Like actual meat. <laughs> not the price. Like a few thousand dollars worth in there. So maybe it's better off to be in that fridge. 18.40. I'm trying to play like a fair game here. You know, I'm not ripping everybody off. 87. Beautiful. Have a great day to you. You too, sir. Thank you. We're eight thousand dollars. That's like four grand. I think we made there well, at least. Correct. I think so. It's gonna look really nice. The Maya something that's gonna come out at the end of the day after all our expansions. It'd be beautiful. All right, this can be a little more difficult with these guys walking around too. Uh, they all finished here. Yeah, so I have no more customers to worry about while we wait for them to kind of finish up. I'm going to have to move some stuff over a bit so I can fit the caches across there. I don't know if that's going to even work, dudes. I'm going to try it out just to see. I think I could put the freezers somewhere else. I think I didn't really like them here anyways. These are just temporary in the way for the stalkers. Nice job. Yeah, I know. Thank you. I wish a door. Oh, I just wish I was just there. So let's see here. If I can bring this extra close to you how close can I put this here without looking too stupid they can't open a door right about there so this could bring it all the way here oh that's not bad actually that gives me the space I need until I can get that wall out of there be you know some space Which is, you know, I'm not saying it's going to take forever to do, but it's definitely going to you know, be some work to do it. Okay, and then, like, the right about there. Cool. And then we have all those things here. We have toilet paper up to yin-yang. I guess we could take this one and move this here right now. Stock people are going to, like, stop moving shit around. Uh, just stop moving it. Is it over with? Okay. I just want to see it's daylight here. 53 customers, two products found expensive, which is very odd because I really don't think there's anything that expensive. Balance is now $9,000. We made $4,000 in income. Again, don't see the cost. You'll see the top right. Uh, balance right now is $9,317.02, right? $9,317.02. Yeah, look at that. Paid automatically. I don't know how that worked. Uh, oh shit, I didn't watch the other thing. By the way, change the stock room. You realize that? Uh, making a little more space. I think this actually works well. I can go in and out here without jamming in. And it looks pretty darn nice. It works well. So let's pay our bills. Oh, God. That was expensive. <sighs> we could buy another... Some ground beef and stuff. Okay, so let's just change our theory here. The same thing. Like I was wondering here. We're going to have to do this. So, okay. Uh, is this open? Yeah, it is open. So, I'm going to switch this up here one second. Okay. Drop this for a second. Make sure we don't... Yes, you guys are like ninjas of food displays, man. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, I mean, I was just trying to, you know, get rid of some stuff on there, but I'm starting to think I'm just going to fill them up. I feel like I'm wasting my time here, keeping us all in there. Wish we'd have so much of it. For now, maybe I'll just do two and two. But I hate having all that stock in there, and it feels like they should be buying more. And where's the other one? The sushi's in there? No, okay, we'll get... I told you, like, I bought a lot of this stuff. But I think I might actually get another one. Wait, I might get another license, and I won't get another fridge right now, so this is okay. We'll leave it like that. We'll, uh... Leave the pork chops there. We'll grab this. But you guys get what I'm saying. I'm going to have to earn more money anyways, so. Very nice. I didn't really see what prices went up and down today, so we're going to have to look at that, too. Market. Uh, the cereal. Cereal. 
The chocolate cereal. Did I see anything else? One second here. Go back up. Chocolate cereal. It's got kind of gazers. Four different items. Chocolate cereal. Where is the other one? Uh, mozzarella cheese. Chocolate cereal. Oh boy. You see what I'm talking about? Like, this is $6.77 now. Damn, dude. It's like, I don't understand why the prices just drop like that. Right now, I'm doing is uh, six point. Which should be what? Uh, 9.7, I guess. 6.97. I was going to put it up by there, but I'm going to just go for $7 at this point. Yeah, screw that. We'll do seven. I round up. It makes more sense. So now I'm making like shitty cereal, man. I'm not liking that cereal at all. I'm hating it. I'm actually hating it. And we do have mozzarella. Look like everything dropped, too. That's going to irritate me a bit. Especially when you try to work this hard. Oh, God, dude. You're killing me in here. All right. So uh, 4.35 for this one. Oh, dude. Just absolutely just killing me. Nothing went up. Everything went down. That's just not right, is it? So what else there happened? That one. Butter went down. And mixed pizza. So butter and mixed pizza. Okay. Butter is so... Or if it goes even lower, we're not going to be able to sell this crap in here. What's he doing? Okay, milk. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. God, so 2.45. Two I'm going to do 4.5 in this one because I still want to make some money. Jesus, that's worthless. And the pizzas are in here somewhere. That's a mixed one. Is that it? No, this one? Okay. Whoa, dude. Oh, man. I'm going to lose 30 cents off of each pie. That's not good. That's really not good. I think that's all there is for today. If not mistaken. Butter's there. Mixed pizza's there. There's four of them, right? Just going to double check and make sure I'm not screwing over anything here. Like I said, if you guys are thinking, we go up and we go up to the... We ran off the top number, you know what I'm saying? It says uh, six, we make it seven. We bring up a buck. That's what it is. So if it's like 6.30, we still bring up to seven. We still keep that that seven. We always bring it up to the next notch. That's what I'm thinking, you know? We'll try it. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, so maybe I should get the other stuff. Maybe I should get the other stuff. Uh, where is it again? Over here. Management and product license. It's going to be some ground. I don't know if I can afford all this stuff. Ham? It sounds expensive. Sounds freaking expensive. This shit needs to go in there. That milk. I think I have extra. By the way, I'm putting shelves here now so that everything's going to confuse me. And where things are. I know it's spare milk and stuff. But I don't know where I put it. Oh, there's one. <laughs> you got spare milk? Yeah, it's, I do have spare milk. And bread, we're okay. Coffee. Can I fill up the coffee back? Yes, good. Get rid of that extra box by mistake. That's good to go. This one is good to go up here. You, mashed potatoes. Always need mashed potatoes. This stuff just goes off the shelf, man. And tuna. Tuna is not doing anything. Where's the tuna? 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 Nope. We're full. Okay. The eggs. That's still full. Mmm. Hummus. Delicious. All right. And I'm, like I said, I'm probably going to go back and do what I was going to do uh, when I did off camera and change it all up again. Because I don't like it. Because I'm going to get that one. It's going to be Ham's lasagna. You see, I, I just need two... This holds a lot of boxes, though. Twelve boxes. I don't know. It's like... I would love to figure it out, but if I have lasagna and stuff, I need more fridges. So we need to invest more money. We're going to have to wait this out. But I'd love to hear your feedback. Don't be shy. Get a confidence. You know, help me out. Tell me I need to get a little more of that stuff. I need to get more fridges full of stuff. Yeah, it doesn't hurt. It doesn't hurt to have. All right, so let's go and see here. I'm going to bring this over there. I guess I can bring... For now, until we get the other side, just bring this up a little bit closer. Maybe a little bit more room between each other here. Still pretty tight. Maybe right up to there. Doesn't sound like a lot more space, but it you know, doesn't look like me in a lot more space, but it really is. I'm saying it there, it's just... 
It's going to give us a little more oomph in a room. I'm going to think enough to maybe be able to bring up the stuff we need to bring up here. Which is the cash and the other stuff. I'm going to test it out anyways. We'll see. I only thing I'm worried about is a lineup. Like, if I put them too close together, like some people were mentioning, I feel like I'm going to lose out on lineups and stuff. It really feels that way. Okay. Right about there, I guess. I'm kind of have to guesstimate right now. Okay, that's good. I need more racks, I know. This is mostly just for the cash and see if it can actually fit one in here. All right, so this register does work. It does, because like the goes in out, that'd be perfect. I don't know if I can bring this right against the wall, because I mean, honestly, I don't need room from us. There we go. Something like that. I guess I need two new registers, don't I? Yeah, because... I mean, I, for now, temporarily, I can put them like this. But then we have the lines just colliding with each other, wouldn't it? All right, just for now, until I expand even further out, I'm going to test this out and see how this works out for us. Because they're going to come in, they're going to line up across here. Are they going to cross each other? Ooh, that might be interesting to see. I wonder if that's going to be something. Because they're going to line up here. What if they'll limit his line? And then my lineup would be just be like right out the wall here. And they can walk out. Anyway, we're going to test it out. See how kind of messed up shit's going to happen out of that. Uh, he, <laughs> you know, got to do it. Okay, so him, we're going to put this here. Like the checkout stuff. It's going to have room for people to walk in and out. Yeah. Yeah, it looks kind of weird though. Won't lie to you. It looks kind of awkward. Put one freezer here. We got a freezer there and a freezer there. So what we'll do is these are just going to be here for temporarily. They're not staying, don't worry. Oops, well, definitely not like that. They're not staying. What I want to see is direction of the population that when they're sitting there and doing stuff too. All right, well, it doesn't look freaking horrible. It's not what I really want as the layout for sure. I do want a lot of freezers across the end here. So we're going to have to invest in that. That would be really nice. So we could, we could redeem another product. Oh, that just ripped me a new one right inside. Do you feel it right here? I hope I can buy this stuff now because I'm looking up $3,000. I probably should wait one more day. Hold on for one more day. Yeah. So get that to ham and cheese. All right. We already had the brown sugar thing. That was the last one we got. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven products. This is very expensive products too. Purchase. I don't know which ones to buy more of. There's 24 now in 2020, 2024. There's actually quite a bit in these ones. Is there anything I'm really desperate for here? Yeah, cheap cereal. All right, we can probably go for those. Shitty ass cereal. <laughs> Bad pricing. And milk, I guess we can do it too. I'm just trying to make sure I can get a full load because uh, it makes no sense not to do it. There you go. Two milks. I don't see anything else that's really that bad. There's enough of those, enough of those. Anything else around here? Oh, we are out of apple juice. So let's get a deuce of apple. That's very good. Now I'm going to solve my problem. There it is. Bam. All right, let's order this. Let's see our new products. And we can bring those back. And of course, this guy's just watching the boxes. Like, oh, do I need to pick those up? Well, actually, he's going in for it because he sees it. We need apple juice, so that's good for him. I'm proud of him. All right, we're going to go back down here. And we have our new lasagna. Bolognese. Okay, so 
Which means with the meat, right? So that's what it is. This is fridge stuff. Yes, I just put it in the fridge. I hope so. So more bolognese. Let's go and make sure we put the price on that, baby. Okay, so this one here. I'm still going to go with my, my original thing, okay? I'm doing 20 cents over the asking price. And it just doing that until you guys tell me change it up so 80 i don't we'll see i mean i bet you some people are gonna say no some people are gonna say yes majority so that means a lot of you have to get in there then don't get mad at me i just want to know your opinion we'll, we'll see how it goes one window this looks pretty good what's that mm. whole point for yet the jambon okay jambon was ham in french and this is uh wow that's pretty good freaking price 12 uh, 25 Okay, that's $4 profit, that big boy. That's pretty good. I'm not going to say no. Where did this go? There. Okay. That's good, that's good. Everything else is pretty full. Uh, more bio apple juice. Okay. We need said apple juice. And uh, this is also new. Breton fromage. So cheese. This place is full. So this is... I thought it would be a lot more meat to tell you the truth. I'm not going to lie to you. At 10 point, uh, 1075. Let's do 1075. That's okay. It holds 12 at each shelf, so... some more milk I have extras I guess I do that 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 nothing else needed there no surprising I did buy quite a bit of stuff though it doesn't shouldn't surprise me too much okay that's good in there what's this oh chicken do you feel like chicken tonight I mean, normally you wouldn't put them that close together but whatever separate the things but you don't talk about you know choice sometimes in our, our place we should also be uh leaving food out like this <laughs> you know you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. here going to stock the shitty cereal no didn't need any more fine uh that is a feuilleton jambon it's a ham pastry oh we got uh some beef. Oh, shit. I kind of want it there. What's this? Sliced ham. Oh, it looks delicious. Oh, it does look very nice. I do like ham. So... Jeez. Okay, there was some meats. Oh, God. More cereal. Okay. They didn't drive any boxes down the street, did they? No. Prosciutto, isn't it? Uh, prosciutto, yeah. Mmm, prosciutto. All right. I think I bought two boxes of each anyways. All right, so I'm going to put the chicken with the veal. There's really no rhyme and reason except for my brain's asking for this to happen. So, you know, whatever. It is what it is. Actually, no, that's ham too, so... Let's put the chicken down here. Okay, and then this is ham and veal. It's not at all together, but we're still going to put the ham here. That's a pretty good amount on that shelf, dude. Right? Cool. And then I have uh, ground beef. I mean, the meat stacks like ridiculously beautifully. Do I have to? Do I couple more? No. Okay. And then what else do I have here? I have the ham and then I have prosciutto, which is super expensive shite in real life. I can do double. 
I already have. No, that's a double. Let me try making money off this one. Hopefully, this is like better cash. I mean, usually this stuff is the cheapest stuff, right? We could run through the prices and stuff uh, right now and see. So 8.75, 8.75. Let's jack that up anyways. Not horribly, but still going to be a little bit more expensive than it should be. And this one here, we're going to do five. Uh, should I put up the high? 580? Yeah, let's just do 580. Beautiful. And this one, we'll do 760. Still not making that much money off that, that's for sure. And this is going to be 520. Yeah, I'm surprised the meat's like. You should get a little more bang for your buck on the meat, don't we? Yeah, I fit more of the other ones in there, so I figured chicken we can double up on. Okay. This is all full, right? Good. A little bit of ham. Now, do I have one for ham? I don't think I do. No, this is new. And... Does it let me put an empty box? <laughs> I didn't know you could do that. Hold on a second. I need to put one for... It's just so I can imprint this on here. Okay, cool. So I think we're good to go. I'm just going to double check that we did everything properly here. Prosciutto. Is that one here? Lucky enough, most of the stuff was fridge related. And I prepped it up for that, so we're good. All right. So that is pretty darn decent. Now, that's all I got, right? That, 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 that. Everything, all the prices are on there. I think we're in pretty good shape. Yeah, I'm just going to double check that I did that one and that one here and pastry i think those are two i just want to double check i did those where's the pastries there they are 12 10 yeah so we're gonna make good money off those pastries and i feel like uh it's a good day to start up let's do this a little expansion a little bit better and turn on lights and see how this goes i'm also curious to see if we can crisscross lines that'll be something new the fridge is not going to stay the freezer is not going to stay there we're going to make a move on uh, a lot of this stuff very shortly it got more racks and stuff, more products. And then I think we're going to uh, line up a lot of the products together. Just do one or two of each. Like, you know, this dishwashing soap. It's just tough when you get, like, coffees and stuff. It takes up so much room. Good money? Yeah, pretty decent. Even the teas, I have to tell you, is not bad at all. All right, ladies and gents. Which cash are you going to pick? Yeah. There we go. First cash to pick is the guy that usually gets picked. It's very interesting. My lineup would be really nice on that side. Let's go let's go settle in to see what it looks like. How does it feel like being stared at now? Oh crap, I know what it feels like. You're still looking at me, <laughs> you bum. Yeah, some shelves are empty and stuff, I know. I, again, all about maneuvering stuff. Like how we're keeping all the sugars together. We're doing all the stuff we need. I think it looks a lot neater than just throwing shite all over the place. This is irritating me a little bit, but yeah, we'll figure it out. I'm not joking. Like, nobody is freaking going to my cash. I've been actually sitting here, and I got... Well, I'll sit in here now just to see. Hello? We're going to see if we can crisscross lines. Can we get a big lineup? We're going to get a lineup in about a couple hours in the game, so not even, like, not too long from now. Things are starting to get busy already. Hello, madame. How you doing? Yeah, you like him, eh? Yeah. I thought it was uh, I thought it was just like where the cash was. My new fair client. Hello. Hell, what? I, that's a hell of a bag, isn't it? I gotta tell you. Everything fits in it. Enjoy. Have a good day. One client. Well, someone just complained about something. He said, that, he said this is too expensive. Really? I don't think it's too expensive. I think it's actually pretty friggin' cheap. I need to make money. You pay staff. 
Rent is freaking expensive. Did you see the rent? Huh? Have a great day. Thank you so much. I'll leave a tip jar if you want to. It'd be really nice if we had a tip jar. Let's see, actually, if I pay my rent. I do remember doing it, but just want to make sure. Sometimes I say, oh, yeah, I think I did. Look at this freaking lineup. Now, can it crisscross? It's gonna, we're going to find out in literally just a tiny bit there. Not too long. Mammoth order from this guy. Got a little mayo on the side there. Oh, man. Laundry weekend for you, dude. 9.90. Have a good one. Working for the... Who the hell goes through the cash? Weekend. Okay. I'll be... You know, there's an exit right there, eh? The freezer in the way or something or what? There's no freezer or anything. Why do they have to go around me? It's pretty friggin' weird, don't you think? Uh, cash. Okay, sorry. Don't you think that's weird, sir? Yeah, you did it right. Way to go, dude. Yeah, it was weird. Why would they go back around behind me? It's like, that's creepy. I would never do that. Uh, for us here. I just finished saying it was creepy, madam. There's no reason for you to go back there. Bond. James Bond. All right, we got this. Are we seeing a line crossover? I, I don't know. I'm talking so much to these people. I, there's a long line there. It looks like he's got no more work. Might just fire his butt. We don't think we need him. Uh, 81.90. Beautiful. Have a great day. Oh, there's a lot up there. Sorry. I don't think it crisscross lines. That's what I'm worried about. If I put them too close together, am I just wasting my time? Because you think they'll stop right here. They can't possibly go through. They must have like the same thing as a... Oh, shit. Sorry. I think I almost grabbed your crotch there trying to grab the stuff. Sorry, dude. Oh, it's horrible. Um, not intentional, trust me. All right. I think I got lights, too. Three... Weird. I didn't say crisscross the lines, but oh god, you scared the shit out of me. What are we gonna ground like that for? You okay? Okay. Maybe I should hug the wall a little more. I don't know. Seems like they really like that path. Yeah, I don't know if they can cross. I think that's exactly like the shelving. I was talking like they you know, like the light up when we. We actually pull out a shelf and stuff. There's like a little line. I wonder if there's that same thing for the actual clients when they're actually walking around. They say no to that. So this guy would have to move a little further back, I guess. This guy maybe a little bit further back. Can we resolve that issue? Yeah, I think so. We might have to play around with that a bit. He's not as if he's going to stay there forever anyways. So, But if I'm going to have to pay him, I don't want to lose out to, on some coin here. God, it's getting dark in this place. Oops. 35, right? Yep. Have a great day. I thought she was going to ask me out. No. Oh. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to move you out of here. Yep, definitely. Give yourself a little more room. 36.10 for you. Have a great day. Yeah, the freezers will have to go back here. For now, till I get the other stuff going. I don't want to take away from people ordering stuff, but. Okay. Boy, those pizzas are going off the shelf, aren't they? You done? Thank you. Uh, he's he's on the cash. I can't do it when he's. I mean, I probably could do it. I just don't know what's going to happen. I don't want to lose this, you know, the money and stuff. And that's especially we just invested a whole bunch. All right, we're going to do eighty-six dollars for you. Thank you for being so patient and standing by. Yeah, I think I'll just move them to the left a bit, and we should be okay. I think we think he should be. He's okay. This is a bit in the way, isn't it? 
Again, I just have to earn a little more coin to make this happen. So, was it 50? Oops. Thank you. Thank you. One dollar. Wait, that's insulting. The guy turns around and goes for a longer... Oh, I thought he was going for a longer lineup. Hey, man, how you doing? Are you the ones who got all those pizzas and stuff? I got it. Really nice. Good amount. Love it. Cherish it. It was actually a really good amount. 130 freaking dollars. All right, so five. And... Oops. There you go. Have a great day. Oh, big order coming up. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, there's no real meats and stuff. You got the cheap cereal. So, yeah. No coupons. The whole place is a freaking coupon, right? Dude, just pull. Pull. Oh, this guy's going over the top. 133. That's good. 145. 157. 169, dude. 169. All right. So that's good. We can push him over here, I think. There we go. Maybe bring this freezer over here for now. Won't disturb me at all. Not sure if he'll... Well, maybe we can block off the freaking clients from coming into this side. What if I do this? I'll stop the freaking guys from going behind my cash. I don't like that. <laughs> gonna find a way to block them. Okay, look at them go right through the freaking freezer. Whoop. All right, let's end the day and see how we ended this uh, with everything paid. Okay. Too expensive. Screw you. Call me expensive. I have freaking darn nice pricing. Salmon went down. Frig, man, are we just... Oh, it doesn't just drop like a couple of cents here. It takes like forever to some of this stuff to go up and in. It's like unbelievable. Jesus. Uh, all right, whatever. We'll, we'll do nine this time. I'm, I'm, I'm not tired of losing too much money. It's going to gouge out a little bit on that too. If you want salmon, dude, you're going to pay. I pay that. That's actually a really good deal on salmon. If I had like $9 on that, it'd be fantastic where I live. All right, so we have that, that. I mean, you could put ice cream right there. Chicken's out, I bet you. The crabs are over there. We've got ice cream over here. It looks offset, doesn't it? Maybe if I do it like this. Everybody's working for the weekend. Get it. You're eating the sun. That's beautiful. Okay, it looks a little cleaner. Uh, these, I don't like them here at all. That's why, too. It's not helping me. But chicken tonight. Do you want some chicken tonight? I got some chicken tonight. And then we have maybe one more on this side here, too. Just for shits and giggles, giggles and poops. Until, like I said, the expansion's completed. We're going back to the freezers here. All right. Well, it looks like I got a lot of restocking to do. Uh, throughout this whole thing. We did get a little bit more bang for a buck. I like the size of the store. I just need to get that other piece of the store going. But I've paid freaking bills. $140 now. I'm thinking I'm going to have to bring up the prices, dudes. I might give it a shot and see if it actually lowers the amount of clients. But I'm worried it's the amount we're going to make at the end of the day. Anyways, we'll find out. Anyways, I'd love to hear your feedback in the comment field. Thanks for being here. Thanks for being amazing. If you guys are enjoying this, you know what to do. Hit the like button, subscribe. All those wonderful things. You guys are the best. This is Game Edge. I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Mm -hmm.